Holy shit cakes, that's a big gun. That sounds like it could hurt a lot of people. Like, a lot of people. Oh, what else? That's where I came from, I think. Yeah. Wait, what was it? I'll take silver. That's different. Let me sec here. I want to check out something. Oh, there's nothing else here. Are you done?
James out of the word. Good itch. Alright, quick save. Anyone need a towel? Another vault. That's different. I'm glad they added a new vault. 118. Maxwell, since like our street. First. Very well. Consider this container. Have a look at the crime scene for clues. When you're ready, we can discuss your findings. You are free to question the residents. But their safety is our priority. So unless you have solid evidence, I would avoid accusations. Okay, so far they're all robots. like the brain enclosure was smashed.
Art is life. <laughs> Without it, we are no different than animals. Perhaps, if all we are is a sentience floating in a suit of flesh, or metal, I suppose, then art is the only true communion with the world. Come with me. Tell me, what does this mean? Hmm. I don't know. It looks kind of like a face. That spot is the eye. The red blotch is its hair, and it's digging its tongue out. Indeed. This was the last piece I played in a series of portraits of Nina. Number 1378. Her emotional landscape is superimposed on the portrait. The reality of the subject is distorted as the ego attempts to project itself this way. Mm. Mm. Tell me, what does this one say to you? It's the war. Bombs from every direction, no up or down, the world turned on its head. I suppose in a way it must be. Art shapes the world, and the world shapes art in return. All art must therefore be constantly reborn through the lens of contextual and historic interpretation. We must ascend. It's cute, I guess. Some people like that kind of thing. More than you would imagine. Truth be told, this is my best-selling piece. I did this series under a suited, of course. This series has made more money than any of my serious works. And I take the whole thing as a lark. What does that tell you about the value of art to the common man? Uh-huh. Tell me about yourself. What is there to tell? I am one of the premier artists in the world. My work is primarily in oil paint, but I have been known to do sculpture or performance art as well. 